known as Ankanwa. It is the largest lotus site in the world, covering 400 square kilometers, making it 10 times bigger than the Vatican. It's such an important part in Cambodia that it's featured on the country's flag. Ankanwa is designed to look like Mount Meru, with the water surrounding it to represent the ocean. It was finished in the first half of the 12th century as a Hindu temple, but by the end of the 12th century it was already converted to a Buddhist temple, which it still is today. Interestingly, Angkor Wat is facing east, which is usually associated with death. Also, its murals are depicted in a counterclockwise direction, which is also found in most burial temples. This, along with the most recent findings of a burial mound close by the temple, all indicate that Angkor Wat was originally designed to be a burial temple. Most of Angkor Wat was made out of limestone quarried 40 kilometers away. Compare this to the Great Pyramids that used quarries that were just half a kilometer away. It is believed in that they would have used canals to get the stones here. How do you get the resources and the manpower needed to make the largest site in the world? Might be easier than you think. All you need is a large city and the ability to offer them an afterlife in exchange for their labor and their money. Till next time, keep those thoughts here.